so let's just talk about hooks in react so hooks are basically functions in react and we can use them to hook into the state and the lifecycle features of a functional component so previously the functional component cannot have any state or the lifecycle features only the class components had those features but with the introduction of hooks the functional components can also manage their state and also the lifecycle events so some of the commonly used hooks are use state hook this is used to manage the state and also we have use effect hook this is for the side effects and also this way we have other hooks also so while using the hooks there are certain rules that we need to follow so first of all we should call the hooks at the top level that means we should not be using the hooks inside a loop or inside any conditions or in a nested function so we should always use them in the top level using inside a loop or condition or the nested function can lead to unexpected behavior and also the hooks only should be called from a react function so this can be any functional component or we can call them from other custom hooks also now the question is why we should use hooks so first of all with the use of hooks the code became lot more simpler so we can easily manage the complex lifecycle methods and we can implement any stateful logic with the help of the hooks and also the hooks can improve the readability and also reusability and thirdly because the hooks makes the functional component so much powerful that they can manage their own state and the lifecycle event so there is no further need of the class component so the hooks have created revolution making the functional components lot more powerful and because of this the hooks are widely adopted that's why nowadays functional components are preferred over the class components so in the later videos we are going to talk about all of the different hooks in details so that's it for the video see you in the next one take care